tree! Listen! Listen, no! It flies out into the sunset. Wait, the god damn it! <laughs> that was our <laughs> oh, that's what that does. You are the worst. What happened? You just let your dad die like that? And your uncle? He just getting his salad tossed by the con as we speak. You know what? Fuck out of here, Jen. You ain't shit. Oh my god, I'm not gonna ski. Spokeswoman for the NCPD. Hi there. Welcome to the show. Uh, hello, Ziggy. Thanks That's why. What's up, BFF? How you doing? Carjackings or drive-bys along the way? <laughs> no, no. Uh, fortunately, the streets of Night City are getting safer every day. We've seen recorded homicides drop from 7,103 a year. 7,000 a year? That seems kind of low. Especially considering I've probably taken out more than that myself. Alright, so... Your boy's been doing some exploiting. Look. If you look at my inventory, you will see that I have $2 million in my account. All of my weapons are uh, tier 2 legendary. Because I legendified them. All right, I'm, I'm a very high level for where I am now, so. Man, it broke the internet. I hope it did. If the internet is broken, that means that I'm the only streamer live. How the hell should I know? The only streamers I want to succeed are me and you, BFF. Don't tell anybody else. Shh. It's a secret. I'm joking. I just want everybody to have success. But if we have to choose, me and my BFF. recipient, Virginia Granchester, citing her most recent book, In the Shade of an Apple Tree, as a treasure of this generation. Manchester, who is yeah. an AI created by Raven Micro Cybernetics, has been lauded for several of her works over the years. Her first novel, Requiem for a Samurai, which was published in 70 languages simultaneously, is a drama set in 20th century Ireland and is already considered the ladies. I've got a lady. I'll take money though. Give me the fame and the money. Thank you for tuning in to N54 News. So. All right. These guys have no idea what type of fucking creature I am. Sure, what's your question? Is it true uh, if you use uh, a cunt is more offensive out here than it is in the States, but I think that was sort of old US. Like, I don't think people get too mad at cut now, but I don't think it's as widely received as... I was thinking um, about swapping some chrome. Everything else. You got any new toys? Have a look. Listen, don't laugh, uh, but been seeing some weird shit around town. Like murals or something but i know they're not real uh just a kiroshi blip could take a look no no the images are too complex for a blip it's like they're symbols that case is the biochip brain can't handle the data overload 
Either that or Anyway, it's I don't cortex. care. I feel like can you do anything? The only thing people can really nope. check you on is slurs. Find a way to get rid like, of that I don't shit. care if you think cunt is a bad word. I'm calling you a cunt if you're acting like one. You know what I mean? So, now that you're back. I saw a weird image out on the street. Uh, seems like your line of work. What'd it look like? I grab the scan, take a look. Tarot. Major. Yeah, I, I don't think it matters. Like, what it you saw I, was I don't, a sign it from a, a higher power. If somebody called me a cunt, it wouldn't offend me. But I feel like most. It, it honestly depends on where. Like, if you called me an idiot and you really meant it and you were trying to hurt me, that would say offend I've got me more. My head in the clouds. That would offend me more than what if you now? would call me a cunt. Major Arcanum. Tarot card, archetype, knowledge held in symbolic form, a stage in your journey through life. Take your pick. It all depends Either on way, what the intent is. You're saying some higher power is talking to me through tarot cards. Or to Silverhand. Or both of you, seeing as you form a harmonious whole at the moment. And I tell you, no! The you know, it'd be a little easier if this higher power learned to be direct. Well, the world is a maze of illusions. It's not easy for the light to shine into the prison of our earthly existence. Right. Great. So, what do I do with a sign I can't understand from a power I know nothing about? I'd start by looking for more of them. The tarot describes a road. So go down it. Still don't know what I'm supposed to do with what I find. Look for more images. They must have some connection to the place where you find them. Think about what you see. You ask me? They've been sent to help you find the truth. Finding the truth is pretty far down on my list at the moment. A difficult time is coming when you'll have to choose which road to take. Then, you'll understand. I don't know. Come on back when you've found more. I'll help you decipher what you've seen. I saw more of those freaky murals. I got all the murals. Did they start making sense? Tell any sort of story? <sighs> all just a bunch of tarot cards. I'm pretty sure my brain's now beyond repair. The tarot tells the story of a fool's <sighs> journey. Show me what you found, and I'll tell you what's left. Here. Hmm. You're still missing two arcana. Judgment and the devil. My guess is that they relate to a turning point in your life. One that's soon to arrive. What's this judgment about? One possible future. Of redemption, transition, awakening. The angel with the trumpet symbolizes the end of an era. And the call to rebirth. So how are you doing, BFF? To a new beginning. I was thinking tomorrow we could do some of our React stuff. <clears throat> It'll be a new chapter for us. And maybe run into the I, I need Got content to put on YouTube, guys. so I'm thinking that could be it. That's the card of primal dormant <clears throat> desires. It'll be react. Though. It'll be react content, so we have to sound react so bad, to it. We can't just be sitting there being like, it also yeah. Represents a false like XQC, we can't be XQC. BMF. Lay for you. <clears throat> What's up with the wandering fool? The fool is you and Silverhand. You've traveled a long road together, discovered your potential. <coughs> we just got started. What do you mean? Your destination is the world, the final Arcanum. Both of you waged a war on the world. So there are two possibilities, declare victory or make peace. Could lose the war too. Herbal QC? Yes. No, that's to have your name true. in it too. <coughs> Thanks. Didn't get much of that, but thanks. You'll understand when the time comes. Herbal Q. I can't explain Nuki. everything. All the Herbal tarot Q can tell Nuki. me is that you will reach the world by one of four <clears throat> paths. Meaning? The Nuki final leg Herbal. of the journey goes through the sun, the star, temperance, or the devil. Could just die. Not even get that far. Oh, come on. You won't let that happen. Take this. That's all I can do to help. <clears throat> Good luck, V. 
on whatever road you choose. Over the castle, on the hill. Vampires, the lot. Checking them out. Their bodies, they never ate. Over the castle, on the hill. I'll let you. I'll let you pick the names. You seem a little bit better than me at it. None of you are going to do anything with him. Thought this guy was so much harder. He was so hard for me to kill. That bitch took one. I choked the shit out of that guy, BFF, and then I knocked him the fuck out. Fucking yadas can't even touch me. Fucking yadas have no clue where I'm at. before got a good memory for faces bars closed sorry to you. need to talk to punch and Judy she in her den yep take the stairs down I'll let Judy know you're coming whoa whoa start again 
again. What is it you want us to do now? Beat some sense into him. That don't work. I don't know. Use lead. I, I don't care. I just want my room back. Your pimp threw you out, that is? Told me I was generating losses. <laughs> Jude is embarrassing day. herself Have again. Hey, where are you going? Oh, Nothing to sit back here. Let it lie. Judy's friend. Stop telling every joy toy you meet to come here. The hell I'm supposed to do with them all? I don't. Must be our rep. Girls need help, they come here. Last time I checked, we weren't running a shelter. Come on, they all deserve a chance. Any one could end up useful. Give it some time. They'll pay for themselves. Chicks can barely take care of them. You so concerned about strays? Go take care of your guest. Suze, we're not done here. Oh yeah, we fucking are. You just don't give up, do you? Got nothing more to say to each other. Thought I made that clear. What or was, was I just too subtle? Everyone in this city lives in their own goddamn bubble. And either you fly high or sink into quicksand. Susie seems to know what she wants. Is she your boss? You come all this way just to play who's who at the mocks? Listen, have you seen Evelyn? Need to talk to her. It's important. Why? So you can make her your scapegoat for your train wreck of a heist? Need to find out who she was working for. That's it? That's it. Judy, you don't need to worry. I won't lay a hand on it. Wouldn't make sense. Fine. <laughs> All right. Evelyn's a doll. Used to work at Clouds. Sig case on my table's got the address. Take it, and once you find Evelyn, give it to her. Megat's hour. Luxurious. Use... Wait. Um... Just let me know how she's doing. Okay? I'll give you a call, okay? Thanks. Thank you, V. A doll. Why am I not surprised? You're an engram in a fading mind. Nothing should surprise you anymore. So we're gonna hit this place, Clouds? Why the hell not? I think it would be so cool if I had a, somebody in my head occasionally. I know it is Keanu. Keanu's like the best sidekick. Forget down. Evelyn. Admit it. This is about Judy's virtues, isn't it? Good shit, if I say so myself. Gotten virtues out of street dealers that were light years crisper. Congrats. No one cares. Apart from Judy. Oh, she'd love your feedback. already got the building I want to go to a gun shop though and get a scope for this pistol I have a new iconic double legendary I want to show it off
Have you played this before, BFF? See what you've got. You buyer? Welcome. Welcome. I know, right? Like, I know you do. Let's see what you've got. You buy her? Welcome. Welcome. Lizzie is fucking. Lizzie is badass. Alright, my so. Yeah, this is a great, great fucking game. I am overpowered though, BFF, because I've been duplicating. I figured out how to do an exploit and I, I started exploiting. That was fucking rhetorical. The Stan's Tiger Claws brother. I don't think it's Tiger Claws. I don't think it's Tiger Claws anything. You okay? Whatever. Oye, despacio! Wanted to use my new pistols. And you gave me fucking reason to. Try as I might. I executed them, BFF. Way I see it, only thing waiting for you here is they were trying off. to extort that guy. Getting off. Place your bets. For the third what if I miss this time? Enlighten me. 
Brain dance chick is hiding something. No coincidence we already saw two tiger claws. They must control the building. Such as five paid vacation days a year. Our sock and the tiger claws are in bed together. Go figure. Every corp plays dirty. Except the streets are more than that. They're filled. So the corpse leave it to the gang. Suits collars and gets soiled. Surprised? Well, hold on. You take a blow-up doll, remodel the hole, and, and that's cheap. That's infidelity. Uh, no. No. How's that any different from some dollhouse ass? Because the ass is meat, not latex. That's so hard to understand. Me, right. No feeling going on, no thinking, no awareness. It's empty. Might as well be latex. Masturbation, sophisticated kind. That's all it is. Whoa. Uh -huh. Makes perfect sense, man. These guys are pigs. I don't care if you burp. I don't care if you fart. But if you think women are property, you're a fucking pig. Captain Picard, or Picard. <coughs> okay. <coughs> they have sex toys. Welcome to Clouds, where we know what you're looking for. Would you care to jack into the terminal? You realize personal links aren't secure, right? Could get hit with malware straight to my core. End up paying an arm and a leg for a ripper dock. We need data from your core to pair you up with the doll. <clears throat> Meaning a biometric scan? Just that. If anything goes wrong, you can lodge a complaint. But that's never happened. <clears throat> so how's this all work? An algorithm pilots the doll's motor functions. It takes your profile data and transforms into experiences in real time. Memory dampers on the doll's behavioral chip block any recall of the session. So there'll be no trace of the meeting? Well, I could say yes, but that would strip it of mystery and suspense, wouldn't it? Once you're in there, you set the stakes. You're saying it's not dangerous, but there's some risk involved. That is one way to put it. One thing is for sure. You never get what you expect. Consider my interest peaked. All right, let's do this. This will be a live session, so events may take an unexpected turn. But don't quit if you feel uncomfortable. You could miss out on something truly remarkable. If you feel unready to handle what comes next, you can interrupt the session immediately. Now for your safe word. Samurai. And saved. Now bear with me a moment. Scanning your personal profile. You should see compatible dolls in just a second. <coughs> matches interesting is that normal or who can say what is normal you're clearly a unique person with unique tastes our system can handle it so who will it be angel or sky definitely sky um 
Looking for Evelyn Parker. Does she work here? Hmm. Give me a moment. Evelyn's not available at this time. Need to see her. It's important. The algorithm knows best. Trust me, it will choose a doll that will thrill you. Our dolls can change their hair and eye color in real time to look just as you wish. I'm not a customer. Well, all the more reason to be excited then. There's a first time for everyone at Clouds. Don't dawdle. Huh. I'm sorry, did she finally say anything useful? Fuck the menu, let's ditch this waitress and take our special order to the <laughs> chef. Yo, Goop, what's up, so homie? Be Angel or Sky? Meaning? Meaning you go in as a customer, keep a low profile. They want to keep their cards Unbanned. Banned. I was banned on kick. Play our own game. Rather go with Sky. I couldn't have chosen better myself. Now for the payment. And you'll venture into the clouds. God, really? There you go. I have two million, but still, that's a lot. And the payments come through. The entire floor. I watch is um, I watch like really, really ratchet TV on Kick, uh, and that includes this show called. Uh, uh, Deja Vu House. On Deja Vu House, there's this disgusting slut whore named Abby. And uh, Abby was just around the pool naked. And, like, later on in the season, like, you can see as the season progresses, the editors are getting a little better at blurring shit. Um, but the end of the, the season, they're, they're pretty good at blurring shit out. But, uh... But yeah, no, Abby was uh, was naked in the pool. Because, like, Abby just got naked in front of the camera. They blurred it all out. And I was like, oh, thank God. Oh, thank God, kid. To you, if you wish to wind down first. Sky awaits you in booth nine. Disconnect, please. Is that it? <clears throat> we have a strict no weapons policy here at Clouds. Please deposit any and all hazardous items with me. Alright, I am a weapon. How do I deposit them? Cloud Only two willing to spread their legs for you. Sad. Go eat a dick, Johnny. Thanks. We hope you enjoy your stay. A certain brain parasite. Hi, I'm Sky, and you must be Vincent. V. Just V. Only people who know me real well can use my real name. Okay, then. Damn, V's name is v. Vincent. I learned that from a whore. Welp, looks like this will be interesting. So, V, you're dying. How'd you know I'm dying? Deep inside, you fear this. Cower before it. So what if I do? Why do you care? Of all the voices in your head, the loudest is that calling for help. Look around. All of this is your doing. There's something in those mirrors. Way back. It's a projection. Your inner landscape. Just what I needed. Therapy with a robo-hooker. I'm not here to analyze you. That's not something I do. 
I'm here to fulfill your deepest, most hidden desire. Uh-oh. Looking for someone named Evelyn Parker. Used to work here. Know her? Know where she is? You need answers. That's clear. Just not the ones you think you need. I asked you a simple question. Uh -oh. Evelyn Parker. Not the most important thing you're looking for, is she? I can smell your fear. You're afraid Whoa. of something else. You just gonna talk in circles? That it? I can't help you if you don't want to be helped. What's next? Meditation? Something like that. Try me. Just answer my question. Tell me where Evelyn is. Don't have time for a debate. Why'd the manager say she doesn't work here anymore? When was Evelyn last here? You know anything. Evelyn had her own story before it collided with yours. But I know you'll find her. You always get your way. I stole this place to fulfill my deepest desires. Not what I was expecting, this. When true desires go unfulfilled, they turn into needs. Am I slamming? We are here to reach for them and beyond. We are here to understand. So what is it I need so badly? To come to terms with the fact that you died. Now move on already. She's talking to Silverhand. Come to terms? Sure. Let me just curl up here on the floor and wait for whatever. Give up. That's what you're saying. You're scared. Because you've given up on your dreams. What happened to becoming the best in all of Night City? Still want to be the best. Never gave up on that goal. Chances of getting there are starting to look pretty slim, though. I just want the world to know that I was here. That I mattered. Instead of a dream, you're living a nightmare. You're afraid of being erased, as if you never existed. Or is it just the fear of becoming someone else? Different? The people I've lost live on in my thoughts. Uh-oh. And that's what I'll be. A memory. Or just an annoying little voice in someone else's head. You don't see death as destruction. The end. But as a change. That thought alone could save your life. I think I might just be... Afraid. So I imagine these things to distract myself from the thought of... The void. Cause that's about what greeted me before. Fear is your most effective weapon in the fight against death. So what now? Now, you find out what it is you need to do. Which is... you're gonna tell me? You've never backed down from anything in your life. Even when you maybe should've. You go through Night City, knowing a stray bullet could end you while hailing a cab. But that's never stopped you from taking action. Going where you needed to go. And it won't stop you now. But how do I keep up with everything that's changing? You have been keeping up. Made an impact. Not a single If this is how sex is in the future, I don't want it. Of becoming something else. I don't want any Likewise, of it. Likewise, you never look back. If you gotta kill, kill. If you gotta burn it all to the ground, then let it burn. Thanks, uh... For all this, jeez, 
Don't even feel like getting up. Few do. But everything has its end. Samurai. Oh, what's going on? Goddamn thing threw me out. I need to talk to you. Talk? You pulled the emergency brake. Ripped me out just to talk? What happened? I do something wrong? A lot of things have been going on in my head lately. This was... different. Refreshing. That's what we do at Clouds. I get why people come here. Come back. But I need something else. Evelyn Parker. What do you know about her? Not much. Everyone's got their own booths, their own problems, their own little bubbles. It's a fragile ecosystem. People like you barge in, violate it, try to rearrange. No. You gotta help me. Please. I'm no threat. But she could be in trouble. Just want to talk to her, find out if she's okay. In case you haven't noticed, doll work's not the most secure job in the world. One day you're in, the next you're out, and maybe gone. Anything out of the ordinary happened here lately? Fine. Heard a customer did a number on her. But that's all I know. Shit like that happens around here way more often than anybody care to admit. You ought to ask Tom. Two of them were inseparable, gossiping for hours on end. The customer attacked her. I guess. I don't know. Real mess that was. Security barged in, handled it. Things went silent. You don't go around asking questions here. Better off not seeing, not hearing. Keeping your head down. Where did it happen? Her booth. Told you. She was with a client. Gonna just stand there or tell me a number. Eleven. This booth occupied now? Nah. I think it's been out of order since, um... Need to get inside that booth somehow. Yeah? And do what? None of your biz. Can you open it or not? Sure. Just don't bother me again. Ever. Talk to Tom. Who's Tom? A doll, like the rest of us. What do you think? An XBD star? Where will I find him? VIP area. Booth 2, I think. Thanks. See? You turn out to be useful after all. Let's take a look, shall we? See that? See what? Nothing there. Exactly. There should be a port right there for the doll to jack into. They rip it out? Wonder why. Blood. Fresh. Not too much. Put it to a wound, rather than a kill. Huh. What's this? Well, the client wasn't the one who flew off the handle. 
like something bitter in the ass. What do you think? Cyberpsychosis? Sounds crazy, but she could have been remotely hacked. Netrunner? Weird. <coughs> not authorized to access the VIP area. Oh, yes, I am. No, sir, you're not. You can take it up with the manager. No, dog. I'm taking it up with you. Here, now. You got any idea who I am? You don't understand that I've got a right to be in there. From what I can see, your VIP membership has been revoked. Say what now? Please stay calm, sir. Let's take a look, shall we? Huh. What's this? Flew off the handle. Something bitter in the ass. What do you think? Cyber psychosis? Crazy, but she could have been remotely hacked. And that runner? Weird. I can't get in. What's that mean? I'm here every motherfucker. Wait. You're not authorized to access the VIP area. Oh yes, I am. No, sir, you're not. You can take it up with the manager. No, dog. I'm taking it up with you. Here, now. You got any idea who I am? Is there a problem? This con... Don't understand that I've got a right to be in there. From what I can see, your VIP membership has been revoked. Say what now? Please stay calm, sir. Or we're gonna have to escort you outside. In a minute, I need to piss first. Uh. 
Will you have anything? Whatever stands to fuck me up the quickest. You better keep this short and sweet. More Two like brainwashed it. sex zombies in a single day is too much. Even. Hi. Um, I think something might have gone wrong here. Not really sure. Uh, I don't have your details. Sorry, no idea what I'm supposed to do. Relax. You don't need any data, don't need any deets. I'm not a customer. I'm here to talk. To you specifically. Not to be with a doll. Tom, is that it? Uh-huh. I need to get in touch with Evelyn Parker. It's important. You and me both. Tried calling her a bunch of times. No luck. You mean to say she's not here? She had an accident. Needed to go to a special clinic in Osaka. Or Oslo. I think it was Oslo. For a new faceplate.
That accident involved a client, did it? Found blood in her booth. Ah, uh, you know, shit like that happens here sometimes. And everyone's cool with that. We get new implants, recovery leave, and, well, sometimes even a payout. Now that I think about it, it is weird you went away so far. Tell you herself she was skipping town? Nah, just didn't show up for work. Wasn't picking up either, so... I asked Woodman what was up. Told me she left, like I said. Where can I find this Woodman? Probably got his feet up in the back office. Except it's off-limits to customers. Woodman, who is he? Mr. Forrest. But everybody calls him Woodman. Never really known why. Okay, Mr. Forrest, then. What's his thing? He's kind of like our caretaker. Finds new talent, deals with ugly situations. Got it. Could it be Woodman finally shed some light on this shit show? Man can only dream. The skull sponges in these dolls. Ugh. That's what they should be replacing. No clients allowed in here. Be a germ and close the door on your way out, would you? As you can see, I'm very busy. Looking for a girl named Evelyn Parker. Got nobody working here by that name. But she used to. What happened to her? Probably did what all the dolls try to do. Found a unicorn to set her up for life. Ah, you could do better. Try Roxy over at Booth, too. Same heart-shaped ass. Behavioral chip will do the rest. Won't feel any difference. You look to me like a reasonable man. I think we can work something out. And you look to me like a psycho prick who's never been ghosted by his bow or bill before. But go on. I'm listening. Oh well. Can't say I didn't try playing nice. Better think real hard where you want to take this. Cause you're really starting to piss me off. Clouds is under Tiger Claw control, isn't it? That's none of your fucking biz. Guessing you heard about Jotaro Shobo? Uh, Shobo had an accident. What Shobo had was a very unfortunate meeting with me. Just happened to be his last. You wouldn't want this to be your last meeting, would you? Of course not. Never wanted to be anything like Shobo.
girl you're looking for, Parker. She ain't here. Tell me something I don't know. Like, where is she? Think you know how things work around here. But you don't know shit. Dolls aren't here to give you pleasure and satisfaction out of the goodness of their soul. They're workers. Their jobs to generate profit. Evelyn stopped pulling profit. No denying that, sadly for her. I saw what she did to the client. She gets spiked or something? Whatever or whoever fried her circuits, it came from outside our subnet. They played their deck like a virtuoso. Her chip was fucking rot. Believe you me, we tried to fix it. it didn't even come close. They common? These kind of accidents? Ever use tech that never broke? Didn't think so. Behavioral chip splits you right down the middle. Some people plain lose their minds. And for every one that does, there's a dozen in line to replace them. Is this you talking it out straight? What happened to Evelyn? Got an order from up high to recycle her. You killed her? No. I found a ripper doc who was willing to take a look. Yeah, he said he knew something or other. The Ripper. Name and address. Don't know a last name. Don't fuck with me. I'm not. Goes by fingers. Clinic's in some godforsaken alley up on Jig Jig Street. Wanna find Evelyn? Look there. And don't come back here. Ever. While you're at it, take the elevator. Quicker you're out of here, the better. Dark fingers on Jig Jig Street. Sounds like a co-ed's wet dream. A pleasant day to you. The next time you so have that urge for work? clouds, an algorithm pilots the doll's motor functions. It takes your profile data and transforms into experiences in real time. Memory dampers on the doll's behavioral chip block any recall of the session. So there'll be no trace of the meeting. Well, I could say yes. You're saying it's not... That it... Consider my inner... So Got a real charm, this place. In that slimy, subterranean kind of way. That's the infidelity. You think Fingers got her? I think we'll find her there. V, if I could see that far, I wouldn't be a fucking ghost on a chip in a corpse's head right now. See, your opinion about dollhouses hasn't changed. Oh, but it has. Before, I wouldn't have touched one with a ten-mile pole. Now I'm thinking a fire'd really make this place shine. condition to find help. Oh, fuck! What the hell's that? 
No, no, damn it. Jesus, the fuck do you want from me? It's all going too slow. Gonna decommish before we learn how to rip the chip out. Wanted me dead. Said so yourself. Made it pretty clear since that I changed my mind. Want you to live now. Asked you already. What the hell you want from me? I got a get out of jail free card. I'd be a fucking fool not to take advantage. See, me and Arasaka, we got a half century old score neat settling. And I plan to do it. That's what I need you for. You might even laugh if it didn't hurt so much. Listen, I know things. Where we can save your life, who can help us do that? You'll get rid of the chip. I'll smash Sokka. Win-win, kid. Soul killer's what we need, and Makoshi's how we grab it. Okay, so... This Makoshi, what is it exactly? Ooh. Okay, basics. If you're jacked in, cruising the net, Arasaka can use Soul Killer, an AI, to trap, fry, and pack away your psyche, your mind, and your soul. Following so far? Sure. That's how you became a construct. Exactly. Now, Makoshi's the place Soul Killer operates out of, where it stores its victims' engrams. Still don't see how Mikoshi's linked to my chip problem. Not the brightest bulb on stage, are you? Fifty years back, ops on the human mind. Mikoshi was the sole place on Earth where they did anything like that. <sighs> Bet it still is today. Telling you, all roads lead there. It's where we'll settle our biz. You yours, me mine. And, uh, how you plan to smash Arasaka this time? Got another nuke tucked away? This time, bombs named Alt Cunningham. I'm supposed to know who that is? Not yet. But you will once we find what we need. For now, we got no time to lose. Need to get inside, Makoshi. I called, didn't I? Promising's one thing, keeping it's a whole other bag. So, managed to learn anything? Evelyn's not at Clouds anymore. Behavioral chip was damaged. Apparently they carted her off to a ripper dock that goes by fingers. Oh, shit. Know where to find this fingers character? Yeah, runs a dinky chop shop off Jig Jig Street. Fuck V. Guys, all kinds of bad news. Heading there now, to find her. I told her to stay the fuck away from clouds. Uh, Alright, later V. One step closer. 
Here to see who. Got a message for Fingers. Comes from the Tiger Claws. And that message would be? Two things. Urgent and confidential. Meaning? Meaning you got a choice. Oh, yeah? You either get your shit kicked in for being slow, or for being a nosy prick. Fine. Let him through, Sludge. Hey! Hands off! I think I'm scared of your skinny ass? You will be when every mox in town descends on this shithole. You got a financial claim? Oh, great! The creature! And, and benign! Just don't turn off the light. I know that fucking voice. For a friend, the king of all we own. Hey, hey. Our prayer to him shut for thy peace. Arise! I don't know you. Shit. Hello! There's a line. Nuh uh, you ain't cutting. Sit your ass down and wait your turn. Let's keep this debate simple. What? What the hell is this? What? There's more of you? Oh, you're already here. Like Could have told me you weren't a door person. Get out of my clinic right now, via the door. Where's Evelyn Parker? I know she wound up here at your clinic. Evelyn. Evelyn. Hmm. Think real hard now. You see, my patient here is likely to feel ever so slightly awkward if I leave half her face off. Upper eyelid retractor on that faceplate's busted. She won't be able to close her eye completely. You think I don't know that? Sadly, this is the second-hand schlock I'm forced to make do with. Third-hand and fourth-hand, too, by the look of things. Consider the alternative. No eyelid at all, no faceplate to speak of. Night City, expect the unexpected. Fine, I'll wait. you to be a big girl now I'm this could hurt several important public service announcements in Arroyo, a terrorist group dubbing itself a trade union has been eradicated <laughs> representatives of night city bear with me just one more second led to financial losses in the millions there Remember, you how's it feel <laughs> fine i guess Looks fine, too. And it never hurts to smile, sweetheart. You, I recall, you visited me before. Whereas you, I can't quite place. Let me guess. Tiger claws? Yeah, I have been here before. Ah, the mocks. Enchanté. These girls know you're chipping faulty implants? You might say so. I'd say they're the very best I can find. See? What's in it? Whatever they have to offer. And they always have something to offer. <laughs> you're a sick fuck. Know that? You're looking for a friend? <laughs> Already told you. I'm looking for a woman named Evelyn Parker. Need to know where she is. Step into my office, please. Many girls come through here. So many. But let me put it to you this way. I believe in giving each of them 
the personal touch. Ask anyone. I'm more than a chop. I'll be more than glad to show you around. But, um, uh, later, perhaps. I'm gonna... Mm. Of course, I can't remember each and every one. Please set your exquisite derrieres. Can't speak or what? Mox have got low tolerance for scum like you. And right now, I'm the one thing standing between you and a particularly feisty and furious member of the gang. So tell me where Evelyn is, or I'll let her talk to you. Poor girl. Tried to help her, I did. But as you can see, this isn't exactly a state-of-the-art facility. You mentioned you couldn't help her. Help her with what, exactly? If I only knew, I wager she'd be standing here, happy and smiling. Instruction register on her chip was burnt to a crisp. Tried replacing it. Hey, Crumb! Nothing. He does not look Damage like Shred, caused by a bro. Don't do that using to Shred. Malware. Sounds about right. How you doing, Crumb? Get to the point. The point? Ah, yes. Well, I haven't the faintest idea where she is. Enough of this bullshit! What'd you do to her, you freak? Now, either you put a muzzle on this creature, or put her down. It's impossible to have a conversation with her around. Jude, calm down, okay? You're not helping. Let me do the talking. Now, Evelyn Parker, where is she? Could very well be on her way to becoming the next underground brain dance, darling. That's all I know. What do you mean by underground? I don't know. I mean, I don't watch that sort of stuff. Snuff? XBDs? I told you I don't know. You sure about this? Four days I had her here. She was out cold in La La Land for practically every minute. It wasn't a slumber party. We didn't have pillow fights and promise to send each other postcards. Where will we find her? I like you. You're frisky. Intrepid. When I realized I wouldn't be able to help her, patch her up, I called my fixer. Two guys came and picked her up the same day. Who'd you call? Who's your fixer? Wakako. Told her I had a busted doll with a BD implant to hand off. Where did they take her? I told you already. I don't know. They weren't the talkative kind, and I'm no gonk. I know better than to ask questions of people like that. You're no gonk? What do you think? Why'd all these girls come in here, let you grope around them? Think it's for your charm? Your caring attitude? They do it because they got no choice. And in the end, they despise you. They can smell you pathetic. <sighs> These guys, what do they look like? Like you, me, anyone else in this city. Really now? They look like you? They look like the kind of guys you don't make eye contact with. One of them was a bearded fellow. The two that came for her didn't say anything about where they were going to take her, what they were going to do to her. Mentioned something about virtues with a moth, of all things. Said she'd be perfect for them, whatever that means. But that's really all I know. You ponder off like she was some fucking inanimate mannequin. Because that's exactly what she was. I'll be outside.
She, uh, overdid it a bit. Temper's been running high lately. Yes, well, you're a far more reasonable beast. Handsomer, too. Nope. <coughs> Literally just need you to fucking... I let her go back to clouds. Could have stopped her, but I didn't. And you two got along swimmingly, didn't you? Exchange numbers, too. Two birds of a fucking feather. We not lose our cool. Said what I needed to learn what we now know. Really? You seemed forgiving to me, like you were letting him off easy. Don't worry. We'll find her, I know it. We'll fucking find what's left of her butchered corpse. Hey, keep it together. You want to give up now? No. Only lead we got's an XBD. Where's that get us? We also know we're looking for something related to the Death's Head. It's better than nothing. I don't get your optimism. Still sounds like a big fat nothing to me. Death's Head symbol bring anything to mind? Anything. Doesn't matter how small. This industry... I mean, market's looking for every kind of fetish out there. It's cavernous. But an XBD outfit would be on the move almost always. It makes them harder to nab, harder to sting. Need to figure out where they're scrolling this stuff. Might be a rat hole of some sort. Doubt they do much shooting on location. Yeah, gotta be somewhere quiet, out of the way. It could be we'll see something to point us in their direction and one of their virtues. Ugh, have to be real gonks to leave a clue. Got a better idea. Matter of fact, I do. A domain called Pleasures of Night City. There's a twin of it on the dark net. Every kind of thing goes on there. Might stumble on something useful. Let me think for a sec. Darknet domain. That's our best bet. Let's stick to the plan. Fine. Here's hoping you turn up something useful. I'll wait in the van. Careful? But I was. And I gotta work out, you know? Anyone wanted to see a jelly roll, they'd sit at home and look at the news. We wish you a safe and fun
my friend. to decide to go in if I don't know what's inside. I'm not about to waste my hard-earned eddies on nothing. Entry is nothing, my friend. I guarantee oh, it'll be hey, worth your time. Honey. Hey, honey. What are you doing here? <laughs> don't want any drama now, do we? Yeah. And he's in it. But seriously, they said it on TV. Don't touch me. Hey, hey, you're in trouble, so if I ever seen one. Get you something to ease the mind. Take the edge off. Got the whole alphabet. CFP, PCP, resin, skate smash, maybe Benadol. Maybe something that'll make you hot. Huh? Sin, MDA, a little LP9. That last shit's so good it'll make you cry. Okay, let's see. Show me. I've been just a bit more careful. But I was. And I gotta work out, you know. Anyone wanted to see a jelly roll? <laughs> <laughs> 
scare, kitty kitty. What's the rush? Okay, you were saying. Hey, you're looking for some company. Stop whiffing for a week. You'll have to find it. And if I don't work, we're both going hungry. Nope. Who I ask about me? Yo, man, you trying to rip us off? I got four bags missing here. That's the cut I got off Pablo. Don't like it? Take it up with him. I ain't dealing with Pablo. I'm dealing with you. That means you and me got a problem. Now, I could paint the sidewalk with your guts, but that wouldn't get me what I'm owed. Yo. Oh, you want to try? Go on, son. Come back some other time. Betting on it. How about you? You buying or just gonna stand there like a pig undercover? Looking for BDs. A particular kind. Particular? You a badge? Give me the best of the best. The ones with the death's head. <sighs> Didn't know I was dealing with a connoisseur. Death's head will cost you, though. How about a discount for your newest customer? Only give regulars discounts. If you're short, then fuck off. Got anything that might interest me? Pleasure doing biz with you.
Hop in. Let me get everything prepped. You make sure the wreath's snug on you. You'll watch while I edit in real time. The old one. One, two. Ready when you are. I want you to describe what you see. You might catch some. <laughs> Recently. Christ, it's hot. Thermal readings are off the charts. Keep looking. Electric corp patch and the coveralls. Coveralls had a patch on them. Electric corp. Mm, could be a costume, a prop. Factory worker fetish. Hard as hell to believe. Hmm. Did it explain the higher thermal readings too? You could be onto something. Scav, gotta be. No one else with that kind of fashion sense. That rich synth got aroma. Cheap shit. Cold, too. Mm-hmm. Buck a slice. Coffee was cold. Like, from the day before. Pizza looked fresh, though. So? Means someone's grabbing buck a slice regularly. Which is not something someone does for the flavor and fresh ingredients. Pizza shares its DNA with styrofoam. Nobody's gonna slap across town for it. Okay. We're looking for an electric core power plant located near a bucket slice. <coughs> EC used to have a big old complex in Charter Hill. Bucket slice checks out too. How can you be sure though? Electric core power plant in Charter Hill. Gotta make do with this for now. Nothing else to garner from this scroll. No time to lose. We gotta go there. Definitely. Ride with me? Let's get going. On our way. Still can't shake it. 
That virtue sample we saw with the death's head moth. If all they scroll is snuff, then... Stop it. There'd have to be utter gongs to waste her on something like that. What do you mean? We're talking about a girl who's not only a natural at what she does, but also has got a doll's implant. I mean, that's not a package you find lying out in the street. And here we are. We going in? Find us a way inside. I'll hang back, scan the subnet, see if there's any blueprints of the complex lying around. Join you as soon as I find something. Let's link on Hollow till then. It's not gonna be pretty in there. So? If you mean to tell me to hang back altogether, don't bother. All right. Going in. All right. Let's get out of here. Until next time, you guys. Got a couple levels up there. Anyway. Till next time.